Hello again, this is Captain John with another one of my video tips of the week. In today's video tip, I'm going to introduce you to radar interpretation. When sailing along the coast, making landfall, or inside sheltered waters, your radar signal will pick up any reflective surface. Here on this first illustration, you can see there are solid lines and speckles. You want to use those solid lines for radar navigation because that indicates good reflective surfaces. Those dots, called scatter, are where the radar signal has been partially blocked. Use your nautical or electronic navigational chart to compare what you see on the chart with the radar scope. Here you can see solid land profiles, points, and tangents, and these provide excellent radar targets to find your distance off land. Look for fixed days of navigation on your nautical or electronic chart and compare those to the radar scope. Day beacons, lights, lighthouses, and ranges offer good reflectivity for safe radar navigation. Click on the link below this video to download a free boater's guide in PDF format of aids of navigation used in U.S. waters. Note the two bridge spans on this illustration. These offer good reflectivity and excellent radar targets. You can also use piers or seawalls. Now you know how to use your nautical or electronic navigational chart along with the radar to identify targets with good reflectivity for sailing navigation. Use easy tips like these for safer sailing on the waters of the world. This is Captain John, and this has been another one of my video tips of the week. Find more sailing tips and techniques on www.skippertips.com.